what's good by tapping to another morbid facts creepy tiktoks like comment subscribe share the video let me know in the comments what you think and let's let's get into it morbid facts part 292 hip-hop legend dr dre has revealed that he survived three strokes over a two-week span after being hospitalized for a brain aneurysm in 2021 the situation was so dire that it prompted Snoop Dogg and Eminem to end their beef with each other. Since they both agreed it was stupid as hell to be feuding right now. The Japanese version of Bob the Builder was given a fifth finger so he wouldn't be confused for a Yakuza member. Who are known to chop off their own pinky as part of a ritual punishment or apology. If you leave lime juice on your hands on a sunny day, your skin can get second degree burns and be discolored for years. It's a condition called margarita dermatitis since people often get it while making margaritas outside. The longest U.S. Pre Damn, his hands is red. Presidential inauguration speech was made in 1841 by William Henry Harrison at over 8,000 words. The speech was so long and the weather was so awful that Harrison caught pneumonia and died on April 4th, making him the shortest reigning U.S. president in history. Morbid Facts, Part 294. In 1984, Motley Crue lead singer Vince Neil crashed his car while driving drunk, killing his friend Nick Razzle Dingley and critically injuring two people in the car he hit. Neil was charged with vehicular manslaughter, but only paid a $2.5 million fine and served 15 days in jail. According to various studies, castrated men don't go bald. Balding is apparently caused by sex hormones that castrated men don't produce. In France in 1386, a pig caused the death of a child by mangling its face and arms. The pig was put on trial, then punished by having its own head and legs mangled, then dressed in human clothes and publicly hanged. In 1758... In human clothes? What the hell? When a wealthy woman named Hannah Beswick died, she left behind a will that instructed her doctor to ensure that she was absolutely dead. She had a pathological fear of being buried alive and left her fortune to the doctor to prevent it. For the next 110 years, Hannah's body was regularly checked to ensure that she wasn't still alive. Morbid Facts, Part 297 80s pop singer Boy George worked as a mentor on The Voice despite his disturbing criminal history. In 2008, George was jailed for kidnapping and assaulting a Norwegian model who simply agreed to a photo shoot. George handcuffed the man to a wall, beat him with a chain, and threatened him with sex toys. The man eventually managed to escape to a police station in his underwear, and George was sentenced to 15 months in prison. According to reports, a kidney can be bought for $800 in Kenya and sold for $250,000 in South Africa. In 2009, a fox pup was stuck in a trap in England for more than two weeks, but survived because its mother came back to bring it food every day. There's virtually no information about Ri Sol Ju before her marriage to Kim Jong-un. She was reportedly a popular singer and entertainer at one point, but all recordings have since been destroyed. It's illegal to own any of her music, and it's that her band members were killed to erase her past. Morbid Facts, Part 298. DJ Khaled used to go by the stage name Arab Attack, but decided to change it after 9-11. In 1983, a 23-year-old British woman died after eating what's still considered to be the largest meal ever consumed. She ate 19 pounds of various foods within a four-hour span before her stomach gave out. She had a sad history of bulimia and purging, as she likely planned on puking it all up, but failed. States that passed laws... Damn, that's disgusting. Allowing a married person to seek a divorce without the consent of their spouse saw female suicide rates decline by 20%. In July of 1945, a girls' dance camp in New Mexico woke up to a forceful boom followed by strange white powder falling from the sky. The girls called it winter in July and caught what they thought were snowflakes on their tongues. No one alerted anyone in the area that the first atomic bomb had just been tested 50 miles away and the snowflakes were deadly radioactive fall. All out. Ten of those 12 girls ended up dying before the age of 40. Morbid Facts, Part 191. In 1988, actor Gary Busey was in a motorcycle accident where he collided headfirst into concrete without wearing a helmet. The accident fractured his skull, resulting in permanent brain damage, and Busey even said he briefly went to heaven. Years later, Gary refused to perform a scene set in heaven because he said the set design looked nothing like the real heaven that he visited. 
In the winter of 2014, a four-year-old Colorado girl named Naomi was at the park with her family. While they weren't paying attention, she apparently wandered off and walked over a frozen pond before falling through. This photo captured her final footsteps before she broke through the ice and sadly drowned. There's a woman woman who's literally fearless due to an extremely rare genetic condition known as urbach wethy disease. The disorder results in the hardening of the amygdala, the part of the brain responsible for fear response. Researchers exposed her to numerous terrifying experiences, and not a single one of them scared her. Morbid facts. Morbid facts. Part 394. In 2019, the wife of Tampa Bay Rays prospect Blake Bivens was tragically shot and killed by her 18-year-old brother. Their newborn baby and the woman's mother were also victims of the random murder spree, which Bivens found out about from a headline he saw on Facebook. A picture later posted, Two days ago, my heart was turned to ash. My life as I know it is destroyed. Canadian serial killer nurse Elizabeth Wetlaufer told her pastor that she murdered four elderly patients by injecting them with insulin, and the pastor kept his promise to not turn her in. Afterwards, she would go on to murder at least two more patients before confessing to police. In 2021, 20-year-old Alex Kearns ended his life after thinking he lost $730,000 while trading options on Robinhood. He apparently saw the negative balance in his account and didn't know where to turn. The day after his tragic death, Robin Hood sent Alex an email stating that the trade had been resolved and he didn't actually owe any money. If you can't stop sucking on these toxic puffers, you should know what you're actually sucking on. It's just cancer and battery. Yeah, that's crazy, man. I, all I gotta say is just stay woke, but tune into the next episode and I'm out.